There are only a couple more episodes left in the Nothing to Everything No Money Spent series and you don't want to miss them. Our team keeps getting better and in this episode we make our own Invincible Victor. Guys, welcome to episode 12 of Nothing to Everything. Now, I am totally aware it has been a while since I've made an episode because I've just, I've got, I've, I've got the God Squad, you know? At this point, I'm just trying to make the God Squad better and better and better. And 2K aren't dropping the most craziest content, so it is a little bit hard to keep building to this team, but I got a pretty good blueprint for this episode. So guys, make sure you do leave a like on this video right now and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And I do want to say, I really do appreciate the support throughout this no money spent series that I have made for you guys and I want to plug my merch guys if you have not already copped yourself some of the official witness 2k merch the first link in the description you can go ahead and get some of that if you want to support me as a creator I really appreciate it so that is the first link in the description comment down below if you do decide to cop anything even if you just want to check out the designs and let me know what you think I would appreciate it so episode 12 is going to be based around this card right here. Victor, the man that has changed 2K my team forever. Now I want to add the Invincible on my squad just as much as anyone else wants to add the Invincible on their squad. It's the greatest card ever created. But financially, I just can't, I just can't budget for that on this account. But we have the next one that I scooped up a long while ago. He's still seven foot tall, but he doesn't have those invincible stats and he definitely doesn't have those badges. Now I have already added five Hall of Fame badges on my Victor. And a big portion of today's episode is going to be grinding Hall of Fame badges to give to Victor as many as we can. I can't afford invincible Victor, so I'm making my own. In the unopened packs, I have got one Hall of Fame pack. That's, that's it, but I mean, hopefully it's something you know there's mighty my limited i can grind there's just the season agendas i can grind anything possible that i can get more hall of fame badges i'd like to get to level 28 which is only about 9,000 xp that's got five picks for us i haven't played mighty my limited this season so we're going to make a start on there to get 4,350 points to get more hall of fame badges we also have this nba 2k 24 challenge which is for a volume shooter and a mini magician i don't even know if he can take that or not and there's also this signature challenge as well which will get another hall of fame badge so i'm gonna go ahead and grind as many hall of fame badges as i possibly can and we'll see what we can give to our victor i'm gonna take a little break from grinding hall of fame badges to do a few things can i get a free shack that'd be crazy give me kenyon martin please give me kenyon martin oh my god i'm not gonna like grind the shack event because the odds are just terrible so we've hit level 28 so we're actually gonna have an ascension board as well we're gonna get some hall of fame badges also got a free dark matter that is more than just a free dark matter it's gonna take us somewhere that's this cruise bosch right here that is one of the five cards needed for dark matter terry the dentist so maybe i will just go ahead and get terry because we're about to jump into the mighty Mine limited streets and and I'm gonna need every help I can get. I got six picks right here though. I would like to level up. I mean, I'd like to just get Baron Davis on the account. It's a free Dark Matter Invincible. I want it. I don't think I'd use him. I've messed around with him on a different account of mine and it's not really a type of card that I really mess with. But like I said, it's a free Invincible. So go ahead and just give it to me 2K. Two extra picks. One of these have to level me up soon, surely. Three picks left. Can that one be it? No. Last pick, whatever, Baron Davis. Keep being hard to get, even though that's not even that good of a card. Over to our unopened packs right here, though. Now, I have the NBA 2K24 Challenge Pack. Now, you get Midi Magician and Volume Shooter from that. And Victor, just, he doesn't need them. I mean, I thought I may as well get this done anyway because it is super easy. But yeah, he's not going to be able to take any of those badges. We have the Tracy McGrady Signature Challenge Pack. I don't know if there's a guaranteed badge that comes in here or if it's only a select few. I'll know if he can take it. Pogo stick, I'm pretty sure he's got that. Yeah, I just checked. He already has Pogo stick, so a bit of an L, but I mean, I can add these badges on someone else, like maybe Terry, maybe. I got a couple of uh, Shaq packs. I may as well open them up. We might get crazy lucky. I would only add a Shaq on my team if it's the Invincible. So if you ain't gonna give me the Invincible 2K, don't even bother. So now I have this season eight option pack, five picks. If I can 
hopefully get five badges if Vic doesn't have. I can put him on 50 Hall of Fame badges. That's huge. I know for a fact he doesn't have Mismatch and Floor General. He also doesn't have Space Creator. That's fantastic. All right, this is looking really good. He doesn't have Comeback Kid and he doesn't have Clamp Breaker as well. He also doesn't have Dimer. So I can't select that. I'm going to unselect Comeback Kid and I'm going to select Dimer. So there is one more badge in here that we know Victor can take and I will get more picks at this at like level 38 or something. Going over to our Victor though, we're going to apply badge and we can give him five more Hall of Fame badges. That is great. We've got two more spots. I can give him mismatch. So we've only got two spots right here that I can actually replace. So comeback will be fine. It'll just slide into one of those spots right there. But we have our Victor on 50. We're only five badges away from this card being an invincible when it comes to Hall of Fame badges at least. But like I was talking about, Terry is a dark matter, small forward shooting guard. It's so cheap to get this man done and we don't even have to pay for Chris Bosch. And it's a card I've been thinking about getting. So I kind of feel like we should just go ahead and add him on the squad. He's not expensive. So we got a Wade. I mean, I kind of want to see if we could try and, I don't know if I should try and snipe him or not, or I'll oh, screw it. Let's just splurge, man. They're not expensive. Let's be, let's be real here. I'm not breaking the bank for these cards. They're, they're cheap anyway. I'm no money spent, but I mean, come on, dude. Like, I can splurge a little bit on a card I would like to use. Slide is under 6K, which is great. James Worthy looking cheap as chips as well. Oh, give me that. That's a snipe in itself, honestly. 4,000. Oscar's nice and cheap as well, which is fantastic. Five and a half, I think. I just bought them all. We're going to add these to the collection. I ran out of MT, but I got stuff on the auction because I did grind a lot of XP. XP, so easy to grind. Like, I am eventually going to get Joel MP. Bead. Got some stuff that's sold, so that's going to put us above 30,000 MT again, which is always good just to buy those cheap cards in the auction house to keep grinding XP. And right here, we can lock in this set. I think it's a perfect time to do it because I didn't have to buy Chris Bosch, and we have Terry, such a dope dark matter. Now, I don't think I'm going to like start him or anything like that. I think T Mac is better. I mean, I could I'll probably replace him over Zion, honestly. So I think I'll get rid of uh, it's getting kind of tricky. I think I have to get rid of that card. I still really like that mellow, but yeah, I want to I want to add Terry to the squad for sure. It's just Terry. I mean, who doesn't like Terry? I don't know what to do with my Hall of Fame badges though, like the ones that aren't going on Victor. I've actually got enough to open up one of these packs. Give me something for Victor, please. And then we're dive, we're diving into Mighty Mine Limited to get to the next Hall of Fame badges on there. Another green machine. This uh, Chet right here is still a card that I would like to eventually get. It's just this Joel Embiid. Would you be cheaper? Please be cheaper. Like everyone else is so affordable. Like I can get this done. Um, my penny's expensive. I think PG is actually expensive as well. Yeah, PG is still pretty dear. So I kind of want to get to do some just to tank that so I can scoop up Chet because that would be a great card to add extra Hall of Fame badges on. One thing I might do, which I didn't realize, is get these games done right here. That's four end game packs. We might get an end game player or something to help us in My Team Unlimited. I'm going to get these done real quick before we dive into My Team Unlimited. So that was a about 30, 40 minutes of offline grinding for four end game packs. I also have this heat wave pack right here. Now we're just gonna try and see if we can clutch a pull. That's just gonna help us in the Mighty Mind Limited grind as we try and get more Hall of Fame badges for Victor. That heat wave pack was awful. Let's start with, I mean, I guess I'll just go oldest to newest. If I can just, you know, get like a Giannis, a LeBron, something like that, something just to help me out. I really hope I don't get nothing out of it. We get a pink diamond that'll probably just be worth quick selling. A Kareem would be dope. I don't know who else dropped with Kareem, honestly. I know they're all in here though, so. Come on, dude, come on. These are like 28% or something. Please give me one, one dark matter pool, one freebie. I'm gonna go Wilt first. I'm gonna save the Giannis one until last. Please shake, please shake 2K. Let me see that shake. Yes, let's go. Okay, so we do have a free Dark Matter. He may not make the lineup, but maybe. If that's out of order, yeah, this, so this should be fine. This should be fine. Can we please get an insane pull to help us in Mighty Mind Limited? Guys, make sure you have liked and subscribed for the Nothing to Everything series. Let's see who we have. 
make it someone good. Please be someone good. Oh. Of course, of course it's this card. It's it's just Darius. Darius Garland, whatever his name is. So annoying, dude. We, we actually get a free Dark Matter pool and this is who you want to give me? He ain't helping me. He's not making the squad. Maybe I can get another free Dark Matter out of this Giannis pack though. And maybe it'll be Giannis. Point guard Giannis. That'll help. That'll help like you wouldn't believe 2K. We do have another Dark Matter pool. We're not done just yet. Make it someone good. I want to update the squad with this card. That is a big body. Who is that? Oh my God. I thought, is it Bobo? Is it Giannis? But no, it's going to be the Poku, dude. I don't even know if he's worth. I mean, I think I will actually add him on the squad. He's super cheap. Like it's nothing that impressive. I hope we don't come across, I'm going to replace Mello, but I hope we don't come across too much cheese in uh, in Mighty Mine Unlimited, but I think we're pretty well prepared. So we've got a last bit of grinding done right here. We are currently level 32. We're going to have an ascension board to try and get that Baron Davis. We've got eight picks. Can you just level me up? Okay, like you fail straight away. We finally level up. Final pick. Do we get the grand prize? Still no. It's actually kind of annoying because I did the challenges to get the holographic Ralph Sampson, but for some reason 2K don't want to give it to me. I did that. That's really annoying, but anyway, we're going to open up these Shaq Takeover packs and I have the Season 8 Unlimited, my team Unlimited, uh, 5 picks. Hall of Fame option pack, which is going to be really good for Victor. But we'll see if we can, I mean, give me a shack. Now that I missed out on freaking Ralph Sampson, who I was really hyped over. Like that was going to be my back. It was going to replace my, finally replace my pink diamond George. But 2K just like, I like, nah, you're, you can miss out on that one. I did make a new addition to the team though. If you notice, my MT has gone down a little bit. I bought someone really good and I'll show you who that is soon. And it's going to be the card I add every Hall of Fame badge I got on that I can't give to Victor. We have an Amethyst. This is the best shack we've gotten so far. We have a Diamond shack right here, I think. We do, but it's still not going to do anything for us. I need that Dark Matter Invincible Phenom shack. It's not making my squad. We've got our last shack pack right here. Can we close? Can we, get an, can we get an invincible shack, please? I need it. You own me because of Ralph. Nah, odds are bad. I'm now going to buy two Hall of Fame badges from the token market as well. Just hoping to get something for Victor, of course, if not Victor. The other guy, but I'm not going to tell you who that is yet. Everyone has Mini Magician, so that's not doing me any favors. And a Bully. I don't think that's going to help us. We have this option pack. We got five picks out of this. That is a lot. If I can get five things for Victor, then he's invincible. But if not, it's still fine. So we can get five things for Victor. And that's exactly what we're going to do. So even though I kind of wanted to badge out the other card, Victor, I got to give it to Victor. So Victor currently has 50. Well, I hope we can give him all of these bad. Maybe not actually, come to think of it. Bit of a mistake made there because actually we'll see. We'll see. I can give him agent. That's two. I can give him killer combos, which will fully apply that one. And I can give him either hyperdrive or handles for days. That's a little bit annoying. I'm going to give him handles for days. Unfortunately, I can't. I don't think I can replace any of those either. So we got our Victor 2 54 Hall of Fame badges. So very close to having the same as an Invincible. This is the other Invincible we have. Tim Thomas. I bought this card to help out with my Tim Unlimited. And man, he is good. He is really good. So that's where I'm going to be applying badges to. And it pretty much goes without saying that we're going to be buying this Jonathan Bender. I don't regret buying Terry, but this card, I have to get him. Five and a half thousand. He can play shooting guard with 40 Hall of Fame badges. It annoys me a lot that I can, I could not add Ralph Sampson. He was going to go right here as my backup center. It annoys me a lot that 2K decided to just not let me have that card, even though I did the requirements for it. But we have Tim Thomas as our starting shooting guard. I've moved Kevin Durant to the small forward. We have Invincible Victor at the five now. And coming off our bench, we have the Jonathan Bender in the reserve spot. I'm still keeping T-Mac. I'm still keeping Terry. These cards are sick. I love them. I, there's, I'm not disappointed that I got Terry. He's an awesome card to use still. He just doesn't make the 10-man rotation. I still want to look at upgrading my center and back up point guard probably but this team is looking really good but thank you guys for watching episode 12 of nothing to everything make sure you like and subscribe right now and i'll catch you all in the next video it's been witnessed